to the Eastern Cape, to the town of Adelaide, where the late media personality Mtobeli Casey August, a former Mshabo Wenene presenter, is being laid to rest. Our reporter, Lubabalo Dada, is on the story for us. Lubabalo, very good morning to you. Take us through what's happening with the, where you are. Very good morning to you and the viewers at home. Currently we are here at the Altilate Cemetery where Casey August is being laid to rest. His body arrived at his home at 7, followed by a service that was attended mainly by the family members and close relatives. Uh, with me now I have a family member, uh, Mr. Um, Lungisi. Uh, thank you, Melumzi rather, sorry, um, Klaoli, thank you very much sir, for your time. Uh, we understand that it's a very difficult time for the family. We saw some people unable uh, to hold back their tears as they are saying goodbye to their family member. Yes, thank you, Babalo. It's a very sad day to the family today. Uh, knowing that we are laying him in his place of rest, uh, it's, it's not an easy thing for us. It's, it's a very sad thing. Including her mother, as you can see, it's, it's hard to let her stop crying. She's been crying the whole morning. Uh, it's not easy. Yes. Tell us about the decision um, to proceed from home to here. Uh, we, we came from home. By the way, the body came at 7 o'clock and we welcomed the body and the family did the ritual, family rituals, then we had a very short service there and then we decided to come here where we will lay uh, here. After this we're going to, to to the funeral service here at the stadium. So yeah. it's uh, that's all the, 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 the program for today. Talk to us about uh, some of the people that are expected to, to speak at his service. Uh, we've got a lot. We've got Savi Tambuli. Uh, we've got uh, MEC uh, uh, from Sport Arts and Culture. I don't know, but she's also the the mayor. Uh, is also the I think it's a Baremon Club Municipality mayor, and there's a lot. There's a lot. ZP who was working with Casey for a very long time, but Komafado will be conducting the, so mm -hmm. the, the program. Uh, it, it, it's a fertile program. Casey was known as a vibrant entertainer, yeah. but to you, I mean, he was a family member. T tell us, what would you remember him for? Uh, he was loving. I said yesterday when, I, when they were into, he was a loving person, caring. Uh, a friend to the family members, a father, a uncle. He was a comedian. When he gets into into the house, everybody laughs. Even if he doesn't open his mouth, he just look at someone, and then we would laugh because we know what that look means. Yeah, he he, is a, he was a very good person to us. I understand that on Christmas Day you called him and um, in the past years you would spend Christmas with him, but he was not available. Uh, our last call was on the 23rd mm -hmm. after he did, I think it was uh, after he did uh, one of those voiceovers. We had a very wonderful chat. He was uh, talking with uh, the mother and spoke as his, his sister. Then when we called him on on the 24th, we we could not get the answer. It, it, it happens usually that we call sometimes uh, he doesn't answer, so we know we'll call the next day. Or if he says that we called, he will call. But this time it was different. We expected the call until one one of the councillors called me and said hey man please come to come home because the legend has fallen then it was then that we we we, we know there's nothing we can do and it's something that was unexpected because um, according to your knowledge he was not ill yeah it was it was not expected but the family uh, said we, we must not go into detail to such things. Yeah, but it, it was said. It's not easy when 
you speak with someone on a call, then when you call, you don't get him. We expect him to call back, but then he's no more. Right. Thank you very much for your time, sir. Thank you. Um, that was the family member of Casey Oka saying that um, they have lost a loving person and the news of his passing uh, is still difficult to accept them. The family, especially the mother, is still crying and trying to come to terms with the loss of her son.